Not only did I meet Michael Yerchak, the voice of Obito from Naruto, he also signed. And it says, wish for whatever you want. Anything is possible in this genjutsu world. Today is Japan Fest. Get ready with me to go. Last year, I actually cosplayed as like a sexy ninja. So this year, me and my sisters decided that we're not necessarily cosplaying, but I did go to Spencer's and I just got like some graphic tees. Hopefully I can be cute. And yeah, we're just gonna go to Japan Fest today because Japan Fest, one of the coolest festivals I've been to thus far. So yeah, let's go. So yeah, my room's a mess. I need to clean it. I said this before, I'll say it again. If you don't wake up every day and clean your room, you're a juvenile. All right, so let's do it. And then I'll probably go get some breakfast and then shower. I finally got the kids at the table. They're eating their yogurt, and that gives me the five to 10 minutes I need to clean my room. Okay, so I just got done cleaning. And I actually do have my coffee on because you can't start the day without coffee. So, yeah. I'm about to go to the shower. Okay. <clears throat> so, I just got out the shower and I did like the quickest shave. I'm just about to do my skincare quick fast and then do my makeup because we wanted to leave at 11 o'clock. Hopefully we can do that, it's 9.45. So let me just go ahead, and get started.
almost done. I'm gonna do, I'm gonna put my setting spray on, lips, shoes, and then I gotta put on my press-ons. And then we should be good to go. Can you believe I was this close to wearing these? I was gonna clean them up, do a little something real quick, but then I opened the first shoe box because I was looking for my shoe cleaner. Come on, it has to be these. Right? I mean, I don't know. This brings more attention to the shirt. But this, I, I feel... Hold on, let me go ask. So, sorry for the crying. My daughter's in time out. Um, so, yeah. We, uh, we outside. I got my shorts on under here. Um, got my shattered backboards. Got my otaku bracelet. And we're about to do one last... We will quickly be applying these. Hopefully they turn out as cute as I think. So I bought, yeah, I bought these at Spencer's along with the t-shirt and a new poster. Bought this at the beauty supply store, so this is like a power file. So let's give it a go. So, I finally managed to find parking, and for some reason, I don't know why I didn't think about this, but apparently, I can't bring my purse in because it's not small enough, and it's not clear. It's literally not that big. So, yeah, I don't know if I should just bring my camera in and hold it. Um, I don't know. Either way, I'm going to make sure to get some footage for you guys. No, any better. But for him, it took an adjust, it was an adjusting period, an adjusting period to have someone around that was also in the character. But once we sort of figured each other out and realized that, you know, I, for me, this whole thing, and I really mean this 100% from the bottom of my heart, all of the, the sort of the attention that the show gets and any kind of, uh, you know, appreciation that, that people show me, is, is the biggest gift I've ever received. I cannot tell you how much it moves me to, to be recognized for a little bit of work that I've had a, the, the profound honor to be a part of. I really, really, really mean that. And so I was uh, open-armed and uh, he felt that, I think. And, um, and so if there was some uh, sort of uh, adjustment that needed to happen, he was able to do it, and the two of us have, have been, uh, you know, good buddies ever since. And so it's it's been it's nothing but fun. It's great, and you know, and the truth is, he's got the Madara side of him is so big that the Toby part is uh, is part of it, but it's 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 really Madara. But anyway, the sharing of it was uh, was fun. It was you know that's the short answer. All right.
You know she has purple hair. That's the thing. I had to buy a wig and I don't know. <laughs> Alright, you guys ready for this picture? See Jordan's ready. Just a little Japan Fest vlog. Nothing nothing too crazy. Please don't let me look gross in this. You do you look fine. Do you feel comfortable? Her hair is her her ask me if she's cosplaying anybody. Her outfit's so cute. Where was I sitting? Yeah, right okay. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Dylan's like, I need my spot back. I don't watch One Piece just sitting down by itself. I make sure to watch it if I'm doing We're something. We're so else. cute. I'm kind of knocked out too. It's like if I'm cleaning, that's my thing. I, I watch One Piece while I'm doing Alright, uh, my camera's a little bright, right? Bro, I'm oh, bro. <laughs> Yeah, I think I found it. Yeah, it's right here. I see. Oh, you was making, you was checking on me? Thanks. But yeah, it's right here. I'm looking at it. Okay, okay. Well, thank you. I love you. So before we end this video, I just wanted to come on here and say that I'm so glad that I went to Japan Fest. I was this close to not going. I can't believe that I was going to change my mind and not go. This was fate telling me to go. And I'm going to let you guys know right now that I didn't do anything else at Japan Fest. <laughs> but obsessed over meeting Michael Yurchak. Like once I saw him, I was just so hyped up that I was like, I got food. And then I was just like, I don't even know what else to do at this point. <laughs> like at this point, let me just like, let me just gather myself. So it was insane. It was actually insane. Because Michael Yorchak was the best celebrity that you'll ever meet in person. He was the best guy. He was so genuine. He was taking pictures. He was talking. He was making eye contact. He just seemed so charismatic. Genuinely happy to be there. He was giving this talk and he was just talking to us when he was on the stage. He was just giving us these wonderful words of encouragement. Telling us stories from back in his time on Naruto. And it was just beautiful. And I'm so glad that I got to experience that. Japan Fest was just so beautiful. And and you should have went to Japan Fest 2023. Not only did I meet Michael Yerchak, the voice of Obito from Naruto, he also signed. And it says, wish for whatever you want. Anything is possible in this genjutsu world. Wish for whatever you want. Anything is possible in this genjutsu world. And not only did he sign my pop, but he also followed me on Instagram. And he also DM'd me on Instagram and just gave me these wonderful words of encouragement. He was so motivating. And oh my gosh, he was doing the voice and everything. And he was saying all these lines from the show. It was just a wonderful time. And, and this was really the boost that I needed. And I'm so glad that I met Michael Yerchak. If you're watching this, man, I love you. And I love your voice. I'm sure that we all do. If you like this video, please leave a thumbs up. Please hit the subscribe. Please hit that notification bell if you want notifications for whenever I post a video because more videos like this are coming soon because this is the place where we uncover all of the hidden gems in the acting world and beauty world. So with that being said, I'm going to let you guys go. And I'll see you guys in the next video.